Thanks for coming back. This is part two of our trip to AJ's Barbecue in Grapevine, Texas. And in this part, we're actually going to the Tap In, which is a bar right down the street. It's a nice one, it really is. We had a lot of fun. I did a lot of editing to uh, actually be able to put anything out. This is Gus, if you haven't met him before. This is my buddy. <clears throat> Goes fishing with me and stuff. Anyway, hang in there. And uh, me and you and Gus will watch this next video. Holy cow. See, all you gotta do is. Oh, man. That. Yep. I told you, man. That is like nugget. I know what I'm gonna do. Turn it over. Get the other side. There we go. Yeah. Really? Fingers are allowed. I thought you liked okra. You're just pushing it but, off. Well, on I didn't the, mean to. I love okra. <laughs> it's now, it is bar okra. So, the thing is with Kirk, when you go to eat with Kirk, you, you'll be sitting at the bar. Okay? He likes to. Bar is uh, important. Yes, yeah, the bar is important. He likes to be close to the, uh, the beer. <laughs> Yeah, I've never heard you complain before, Kenny. Yeah, you won't hear me complain now either. <laughs> now all of a sudden you're the. See, all I drink is water. A tour. Good drink. Giratto. Mm -hmm. A lot of seasoning right there. Another beer? A lot of flavor. There's a ton of flavor. Oh, that one. Go for it. Cut. I've even got some over here. Yes, sir. <laughs> I'm not bashful. No, don't be. Thank you very much. Oh, yeah. Wow. Yeah, see what I mean? You know, let's you see what this place sounds like. I'll tell you what. Really hard to be to be fruit. <laughs> Tastes out good, you know, good flavor. One, huh? you know, hey, I you, like you, the brisket, I like it, but the beef ribs. You didn't tell me um, about the coleslaw. How's the coleslaw? Okay. Yeah, the vinegar base. Mm -hmm. It's vinegar base. The nice thing is, you you some, sometimes you eat coleslaw, it's like drowning in fluid and stuff. Uh huh. This is dry, but it's obviously. Or a pickle. Yeah, I like it to be crisp. And it's it's crunchy. Yeah. It's not you know no, that's like, like exactly. soggy. Well, that's what it looked like it from way over here. Oh look, it's is that Mickey Mouse? <laughs> yes, my golly. <laughs> <laughs> um, not anymore. Yeah, I've always liked a crunch in my coleslaw. Mm -hmm. Crunch, not drown. And then I know everybody doesn't like vinegar, but that's really good. I mean, we've been to a lot of places around this area, and it's it's been nowhere near as good as this place. I mean, I have to agree. No. I mean, there's been a lot of places that even charge more money, and, and no, no. Prices have right. no business doing it. This is really, really good. A, I got the video going, so I won't mention it, but there is one place we went to. Um, <laughs> I know all about it. Yeah. <laughs> They were real proud of their sauce. No, they be should be. The sauce, sauce was good. You, it's, it's a good thing that the sauce was good because I don't know what they were doing with the barbecue. Exactly. <laughs> well, I think they put it in the oven. I mean, so, yeah. You know, it's call a spade a spade. Yeah, well, tuna is chicken of the sea. Although a lot of people, not according to Jessica Simpson. But anyway, well, it's, um, but there was a, she thinks there's, chickens there's a swim. school of thought. <laughs> There's a school of thought you never put cheese with seafood. Never what? Put cheese with seafood. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you do. And I was like, No. And no, no, I saw this several times. I mean, you're like, No, no, you don't want to do this. Yeah. I was like, Wait a minute. The best shrimp scampi I ever had was shrimp with a layer of cheese. And shrimp oh. and layer, you know, with, yeah. with, with well, butter and, you know. It's dairy, dairy products with seafood. That's what I used to be the old rule. Is you didn't mix dairy products with seafood. That's what cheese is. But I know, that's what I'm saying, though. Yeah. It's like tuna helper. Well, tuna helper's got milk in it, you know. And it, they sell. Yeah, I know it. There's tuna. nothing wrong with it at all. I love tuna. But you're mixing milk with tuna, and it's great. So, anyway, we'll do our review on tuna helper later. Yeah.
So, uh, guys, I think um, okay, so the okra was obviously good. Steve really liked the taste salad. I wouldn't crazy back to this guy. Onions in, I'm just not an onion guy, but it has a real good flavor. Good taste salad, you like sweet taste salad. It's not much it was a little bit sweet. But it's not overly sweet. No, no, not at all. Baked I, I thought it had a great flavor. Baked beans are awesome. Oh, yeah, you had the beans. You had the beans, and they're a little bit tart, but that's okay. A little vinegary or something, but they're really good. And, um, and the coleslaw is not overly... Again, yeah, we mentioned it before, crisp coleslaw. Sorry, yes. yep. crisp. crisp. Um, pulled pork I thought was really good. Yep. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't get, did you eat the rest of them ribs? Well, that's, the, that's well, no, I'm talking about the pork ribs. Yeah, that's them right there. No, oh, okay. There's some right here. There's you got to watch these guys, man. What are you talking about? Yeah, you're, you're too busy over there, so we were pausing. Hey, look. Okay. Well, see? <laughs> <laughs> so... But the, uh, I, thought, I thought the pork ribs were good. The uh, sausage and, was really good. I really yeah, I mean, again, I mean, I've said this on previous videos. I don't mind spicier, but those right. it has bad good bad flavor. Bad but kind of like what you said when you when you first taste it, it's like mild, and I was like, okay, that's that's going to be mild, and mm -hmm. then all of a sudden it was like, oh, okay, there it is. You yeah, know, yeah, was, came through. You, you very rarely get sausage that does that. You, they usually no, it's, slaps it, you in the face. It is what it is. Yeah, you know, know, first bite. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, Kirk it's, it's, didn't really like the beef ribs. <laughs> yeah, there's none left. Yeah. <laughs> he ate yeah. the whole damn thing himself. Me and Steve still have some left over. He's taking the bone home with him. Yeah. <laughs> you mean there's bone left? He didn't eat the bone? No, the dog's going to get the bone. Oh, the dog's getting the bone. <laughs> the dog. uh -huh. That's what he's telling us. Mm -hmm. I swear to you. Okay, well... I'm not sure if that Rhodesian <laughs> is big enough for that bone. Uh, you think okay. 76 pounder Rhodesian will tear Trust me. But, well, well, all right. So, and he's got a great selection of craft beers. He's got yeah. all this stuff. I mean, I'm telling you, you can't lose coming. Yeah. This yeah. Is, I mean, this is really good. Great it's ambiance. It's not a huge place. It's a small place. Ambience, but I know. There's money. If you, you, if you can't you can pay your pay bill, you just reach yeah, up, grab one off the ceiling. Oh, wow. You need to turn the camera up there. Yeah, I did. I got it. Yeah. Got it earlier, man. Yeah, we had a lot of people come here just for the dollars. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, there's some five and ten. So, um, okay, y'all take care of the bill. I'm gonna go outside and and uh -huh. and, and video and stuff. Y'all pay for all this, and uh, I'll I'll owe you. I'll, I'll give you five why do you bucks here. Video when you're doing. Oh, I gotta go, out, I'm gonna go outside. And do it. I'm just videoing the bathroom oh. in here. You know, that's how cool this place is. <laughs> Well, okay, Don, no problem. We'll take care of it. No. Uh, we think this is a great place. Yeah. We do. So, we do. We're, but we're. Love it. And I guess Kirk has somewhere else we're supposed to go after this. Yes. I don't think we'll be eating there. I'm going to have some more beans to clear out the bar. Oh, yeah. Nice. I'm sitting right next to him. And you will right. continue to do so. No. no, I told you. I'm going, out, I'm going outside right now. I'm going outside. Rainy day here in Grapevine. We are going in there. Watching hockey. <laughs> Pretty good cigars, gentlemen. Very nice. Yeah, very nice. Yeah, good cigars. I can't bitch. Yeah. Mine was better than his. And it cost me seven dollars less. Mine was. Oh, much really? <laughs> mine, was really? mine was much better than. His. Was it? No, I I tried yours. It's not that good. You, you did not try mine. <laughs> yeah, he did. When you went to the bathroom, he did. <laughs> I have a sore. Here uh, you need to go get a shot, buddy. I hate to tell you. No, I probably need to get a tetanus shot. <laughs> and you know what's funny? That doesn't surprise me at all. No, it shouldn't. I said it can't be that good. So, um. It was very good. Very smooth. It is. It was it? Very, it's very smooth cigar. But I don't have a Maduro like you do. It might. It, I it, thought it was. It's kind of like my Patron. It's very smooth. I thought that cigar of yours, his was smooth. 
Yeah, because he fried it too. That's yeah, we, he passed it down. He said, man, now, the guy at the end of the bar here, he wasn't that crazy about it. He wasn't that crazy about it. Yeah. He got good and wet too. Yeah, I know. He got <laughs> slobbered on it. But. Oh, I just filled this up this morning. Oh, there we go. You uh, must have been here. You going to be common, doing some welding? The common thread yeah. on this whole thing is Kim. So it's Kim that's I am. I am the common thread, yes. I like the way you spread around the wrist. <laughs> as long as I'm not as directly complicated. <laughs> Oh, you know what? I think we're going to have a split with kale. Gentlemen, a toast? Well, i got to have a beer for uh, uh, oh. hey, hey, what's his name? Oh. We, we forgot somebody. Hey, young man, yeah. I'm going to have me a Smithwick. Yes, sir. You yeah, just be different. A know? what? Smithwick M. Okay. Those are good. Are they? Yes, they are. I have a Dallas Blonde. <laughs> Would you drink? Don't mind the blonde part, the Dallas part, though. It's colored like that. What, uh, what, what are you drinking there, Kurt? Thank you. What are you drinking? Cheers. Dallas Blonde. Dallas Blonde, same thing I got? Schlange. Schlange. There you go. All in all, a successful day. So far. Oh, yeah. Good call. Necker of the gods. First question there, uh, Mr. Kimmon. What? Have you bought any red, red, red runners yet? <laughs> no, not yet. But we need to talk about that. Are we have a fishing like, video are coming you up. On the of yeah. I can't find them. I was I can't find them. I was at Cabela's last weekend. I cannot I find redheaded headed road runners. I'll sell Academy. you. Academy. Yeah. I was in a business. I've got to make some money Dude, here. Dude, I'm charging two you. Bucks, two bucks a I'm lure. charging you, eight. Charging me. You're charging him <laughs> ten. <laughs> okay, ten. Yeah. Take advantage yeah. there, of, there's of a gotta friend. There's got to be a middleman in every transaction. Uh, I guess so. <laughs> but two middlemen? Capitalism. The American way. Yeah. American <laughs> way. Supply and demand, baby. I'm beginning to like that socialism yeah, more all the time. Down the river, ten bucks a lure. <laughs> yeah, if you're on the water, it goes up. <laughs> I'll pick you up and throw you off the boat. <laughs> <laughs> World Wrestling Federation action. <laughs> Yeah, I'm bringing a metal chair with me. Kirk, Kirk left the party early. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Kirk well. tried his swimming capabilities. The current will take you wherever you. You don't have to swim. The current will take you down. I mean, as long as we're up river, you just ride the current back. All the way to the coast. Yeah, all the way to the coast. You can go to the beach. I know you paid seven dollars more for that cigar than this one. What kind of cigars? Yeah, what kind of cigars are y'all smoking? What, what is yours, Steve? This is the Arturo Fuente Reserva. Arturo Fuente Reserva. What'd you call me? You said a hole. That's You're an a hole. Am I hearing things? This is only released once a year. Once a year. And it's uh, the wrapper on the outside is different. Oh yeah. Yeah. If you, if you lick it. It looks, you, you can taste it. It looks yeah. like it's going to be like really harsh because it's dark, but it's very, very smooth. Yeah, it's a dark color. Yeah, very smooth. This is a natural Padron. Hey, it's a what? This is a Padron 1964. Padron, Padron 1964. Once you ever get dark, you never go back. I guess so. <laughs> I think we're going to end with that. I hope you enjoyed part two, and I hope you watched part one. Part two would make a whole lot of sense if you didn't watch part one, too. We got more videos coming up. You may want to subscribe, go along with us, and go fishing and some more barbecue restaurants, uh, maybe some other restaurants. Maybe uh, maybe my wife will show you how to make her seafood fondue. It's got crawfish in it and shrimp and spinach and mushrooms and jack cheese. Anyway, if you've ever been to Papa Do's and seen their seafood fondue, that's what it is, only better. Anyway, we'll see. Keep your eyes open, subscribe, and uh, hit the little notify bell, and uh, you'll know when a new one comes out. What are you doing over there, Gus? Ever present. Anyway, till next time.